Welcome to Vlogmas Day 2. I know I'm looking crazy. Um, but I just took a shower because you know you gotta be clean to start today. It's really late. It's all like it's like three or something. But I laid down all day because I ain't had nothing to do. I have an accounting um final to take, but I don't feel like taking it, right? It's not due till tomorrow, so yeah, since I just took a shower, I just started some laundry. So I have three washers going right now. That's going to wash for like 36 minutes. And now I'm just going to clean the shower out. Because it's not even dirty. But I just think it should be clean. Like I try to clean it as much as possible. So yeah. I wish like the shower curtain would like just say stretched out so I can like spray it. See you guys spray the shower curtain. Like, sometimes when I do room inspections, people's shower curtains literally be brown. Like, they be brown, have, like, little dots. No, clean your shower curtain. Like, I feel like this is dangerous to your health to be in there with the shower curtain dirty. Like, stuff be growing on that. So, I'm going to let that sit. I'm much like, why are you running out the bathroom? Yeah, those fumes begin to me. So, after I spray the product, you know, I let them sit for a minute or so. And then I'm going to go back. So, yeah. My room isn't really dirty or anything. Yeah, my room is pretty decent. <sighs> I have a few plans today. Well, what I want to do is, of course, wash clothes. That was my ultimate plan, wash clothes today. And um, take my accounting exam, like, later on tonight, like, tonight, tonight. I'll probably do that when I'm home, but I'm trying to think. I really want to take down my hair and, like, do just my puff that I... I like to wear but I gotta wash it in my hair my hair is so nasty like my hair is disgusting because I haven't washed it since I took the crochet out which I took the crochet out like last week and I just put a wig on my braids so my braids are horrible but yeah I'm hungry though I haven't eaten I haven't eaten anything all day why is the light so bad okay anyway yeah I haven't eaten all day and I really don't know what I want. Let's see what's in here. Yeah, my fridge is like, yeah. Maybe I can whip something up quick. Um, got a chicken alfredo meal, which I just recently bought these. So maybe I'll do like some chicken breast and, and rice or something. That's easy, right? Instead of spending money. Well, I do have that dressing that Oriana gave me. I might eat that. I need to throw that bread out. It's probably not bad, but I think it should be thrown out. Um, let's see what's in here. It's really not much in here, y'all. Like it looked like a lot, but it's nothing in here. I think I said that last time, but I promise y'all. Wait, I bought pineapple. Many be snacks in here. Like I literally just found my mango snacks yesterday, and I was like, I had mangoes. Anyway, yeah, like only thing in here is some rice, chicken broth, green chilies, refried beans. So stuff to make quesadillas, but I don't got no ground beef or nothing like that. And man, which I don't have any buns or hamburger meat. I think I'm not going to the cafe and getting a pizza, but I don't know. I'm just hungry. Okay guys, so I just went to the cafe and got a pizza. Um, this is like my first actual meal for the day besides the Twistlers I ate earlier. Yeah. 
can see I took down all the braids that were in my hair. Okay guys, so I'm about to like deep condition my hair. But I wanted to show y'all it before I put it. Because I feel like I never like show my natural hair. But yeah, I just used the Aussie conditioner 7 in 1. And my hair keeps shrinking up. That's why like I honestly just want to chop it off because it doesn't, I don't know. I'm tired of being natural. Like, I mean, I don't know. I just braid it up most of the time, but it's just annoying. <clears throat> and this brush right here is kind of like a dimming brush, but I got it from the Beauty Supply. It was like two bucks versus, I guess, the 10 to 12 dollars the actual dimming brushes. It's pretty good, too. Yeah, it's pretty good at, like, you know, just getting in there only thing is whenever i like have my hair braided up for a super long time like my hair sheds so freaking much and which is normal because like they say 100 strands fall out a day but my thing is like okay i detangle before i wash my hair okay i detangle while i wash my hair and i detangle with conditioner every time i detangled a lot of hair comes out and it's like super annoying like dang every time i detangle every stage of the tangling like it's still a lot of hair like i literally just cleaned this brush out and there's more like i don't understand i don't know if it's because my hair is just curly and it's like you know hiding in there or what but every time i detangle more hair comes out and it's just ugh. i be trying to get in there you know i really be trying to get in there to make sure i get all of it out man I really be trying but my hair shrinks up like look at that like this one was just right here right and it shrunk up this one is shrinking up right now that's why I'm just tired of my hair it's always shrinking up it don't want to act right but I never really formed like this regimen where I you know like all the natural people be having I never really formed one of those or like found the exact products that you know work well for like washing goes I've never just found those items so maybe that's my goal for the new year to like get to know my hair more I want a color job I want my I want to redo my color job and I want to um straighten my hair for winter but I live in Alabama and it ain't been winter yet so I'm confused like I don't know anyway I'm gonna put my plastic bag back on my head tuck these behind my ear I need to go get my last load of clothes out the dryer. What happened? It's kind of funny. Like, I don't know if I didn't start the washer or something, but my clothes were like dry when I opened the washer door. And I was like, what's going on? So, I just restarted that load. Because I'm pretty sure I pushed start. Like, I feel like I saw the time going down. But it's whatever. It's cool. So, I just redid it to make sure. And how I'm just waiting on that load to finish my other loads are done I just need to fold them but I don't feel like folding them either so go figure and my auntie ain't even call me so you know what I'm talking about I'm trying to figure out how much time this is <sighs> yeah I feel like watching because of Winn-Dixie I like that movie make sure my edge is in there no hair back is out. All right, we good to go. Oh my gosh, y'all about to cry. Cry was about to plan a folding clothes. Oh like, look, I have clothes everywhere. But I'll cry because by show, they always hurt on the you feels, know. man. It's called Drop That Diva. I'm almost done with it. I'm on like season six. But <laughs> they love turning up the feels on me, man. Like, <sighs> Get it together, Subby. I swear, I will cry at anything other than real life situations. Like, I will cry at a movie. I'll cry at a cartoon. All of that. But something real life, I'd be like, oh. <laughs> I don't know why. Man, I did not. I was not trying to cry, man. I was so weak at my soul. Ooh. <laughs> But they got me, man. Hey, they got me. 
happened? The show just be so good, man. Like, okay, basically this boy, right? He was, um, so they ended up finding his birth dad who wasn't, he thought his dad was dead, basically. So, but they found him this really nice, like, family to take him in. He was going to be like a big brother to two younger siblings. And the family was perfect. They had like a beach house. The family was perfect, but his dad, he was like, hey, he was like, say him, I want to meet him. So they got the dad to come in and to like basically sign a paper. But before he would sign a paper, he was like, I want to meet the boy. So he met him and they talked and then he was like, they shook hands like he was like that's what you wanted right and he was like yes he shook his hand and the guy was like you know i got a small apartment and humble was like i like apartments and then he was like um he was like i don't know much about raising kids he was like i don't know much about parents i was like what did you do and he was like i work security during the day and homeboy said i'm in school during the day and and he was like, as long as you come home at night and stuff like that. I was like, oh my god, like, oh my god, like <laughs> it hit me, fam. But yeah, that's all. Let me let me continue to fold these clothes up because I don't have time for waterworks right now. I need to wash this conditioner out. But this show just be so good, man. Again, the show is called Drop Dead Diva. It's really good. It's about this girl who basically dies. And she wakes up at somebody Hey, okay, hair's clean, towel dried. It looks crazy, y'all. My hair always looks crazy when I, like, towel dry it. But who cares? Anyway, because I literally just suck all the moisture out of it. But right now, I'm about to put my hair in a puff. I have a video on it, so I'll link the video right here so you guys can check out that puff video. So we watching the circle. We had dinner and everything. We had a dance party session. That's that little girl here. You got pregnant lady? That's dirty, bro. Why y'all got? Y'all can have no pregnant. They killing new life, man. Check out this movie called The Circle, y'all. Okay, for real. What's going on? Why he got his hand up? <laughs> I don't understand. One second.